Cheryl could fork out a hefty bill after being accused of using a tax avoidance scheme. The Girls Allowed Singers Company, CC Entertainments, is said to have paid capital gains tax instead of income tax and national insurance which come with higher rates. It's reported that Cheryl, 38, recently lost an ongoing legal battle, with a judge concluding that her personal firm was culpable of straightforward profit extraction, using an artificial employee bonus scheme. Judge Jennifer Dean noted according to The Sun, the appeal of CC Entertainments is a straightforward profit extraction case where the single 100% shareholder, Tweedy, signed a contract of employment and was awarded a growth securities ownership plan said to qualify as an employment-related security. Responding to the court's decision, a HM Revenue Customs spokesman told Metro. Co.uk, we welcome this ruling which confirms these were tax avoidance schemes. We are committed to ensuring that everyone pays the right tax at the right time to help fund our vital public services. HMRC can now ask her to repay the tax, including compound interest, but not fines or penalties. It's not known how much the bill is but CC Entertainment's registered profits of £120,000 in 2020. A spokesperson for the accountancy firm which marketed the bonus scheme did not comment on the ruling. However, Grant Thornton previously told The Times, the growth securities ownership plan was developed to help our clients link their employees' contribution to the performance of their businesses and are not free of tax. In common with other incentive plans, if there is growth in value in the share or security that is issued to the holder of those shares, securities, then that increase in value is correctly taxed as a capital gain. He added, it's a common approach. We have been open and transparent about this plan from the outset, including the HMRC. In recent years, Cheryl, full name Cheryl Tweedy, has taken time out of the spotlight to focus on being a mother to four-year-old son Bear, who she shares with ex-boyfriend Liam Payne. Opening up about her private life as a mother, the fight for this love singer told Women's Health UK, my approach to life and the world changed when I became a mother to bear. I have a completely different perspective now that I'm responsible for another human. I care less about silly stuff and more about the important things in life, like bear's health and happiness. She released her last solo album, Only Human, in 2014 but briefly returned to music in 2018 with the single Love Made Me Do It. But after a lukewarm reception, Cheryl put music on the back burner again and it's believed she currently has no plans to record new material in the near future. Fans were delighted, however, when she made a brief return to the stage in September 2021 to perform at the Mighty Hoopla Festival in Brixton's Brockwell Park, where she treated the audience to throwback Girls Aloud hits and her solo bangers. Last year, she partnered with Feel Multivitamin, a subscription-based supplement and appears in TV adverts for the brand.